Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So on the channel, we talk about Windows updates at length and in detail. So I thought this may be a good time just to discuss a feature called Active Hours. That is a Windows update component on Windows 10 and Windows 11, which helps to minimize and reduce the chances of a system reboot to apply system updates. Because as many of you may well know, um, most Windows updates require a system restart. And if you are in a workflow and your active hours um, isn't set correctly, obviously that can then disrupt, that system reboot can disrupt your workflow. Now, active hours on Windows 10, the feature can be found on the Windows Update page under Pause Updates. So on Windows 10, you'll find active hours under Pause Updates. For Windows 11, we've got to go a little bit further and click on Advanced Options. And here you can see active hours. Now, from here, it's more or less the same thing on both operating systems. Now, just a quick um, kind of uh, recap about how active hours actually works. What it does um, is Windows basically uh, tracks you when you're actively using your, your PC. And then it schedules reboots when the computer is not in use. So that's something that goes on behind the scenes. Now, the problem with this is... If we look here, we can see that active hours on both Windows 10 and Windows 11 is set to automatically. And then as mentioned on, in my um, example, it's tracked me where I use my computer mainly between 05 in the morning and 1800 in the evening. Now that 0500 is a little bit optimistic. I don't sit down that early um, on my PC. So as mentioned, although this gives you a kind of guesstimate when you um, are using your computer. It's not perfect and it can have problems and issues. So what I would suggest then is that you can basically um, configure Windows 11 and Windows 10's active hours manually from the settings. So what you need to do is if you are having a problem with active hours and you are still getting reboots when your system uh, is in use, then all you need to do is you click on this toggle and then you set to manual to manually um, change your active hours and here we go and then you can have a start time and an end time so you can manually adjust that and it's the same kind of uh, it's the same steps on on windows 10 and then obviously um when an update after you've set this uh, manually and when an update is pending for installation then windows won't reboot your system during that start that that start time you've manually set and the end time the end range time that you have set and um, that is part of this feature. So I thought I'd just put that out there because obviously this is part of Windows updates and we do talk about Windows updates quite a lot on the channel. And I thought this may be a handy little topic just to discuss. And obviously if you want to put everything back and let Windows decide when your computer is in use, you pop that to automatic and then it'll adjust that time automatically um, on your actual computer usage. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.